first steps that we learned was the soldier's march. And we learned things to add in individual motions, like Mitchell and the Bowman, just like the toe. But what would happen if, instead of doing a Mitchell or a Bowman, you did a little pull at the end? If you did that little pull with one foot, that would create a whole new step. It's called the buck step. You go to any flat footing classes, and this is one of the first things that you always learn. It's the last in my class, unfortunately. <laughs> but that buck step, when you add that individual motion, that pull looks like this. Now, I taught you those Bowmans and the Mitchell for a reason. One of the reasons is, is those Mitchells and the Bowmans flow into so many of the things that you're going to learn later on. I want you to listen and watch my right foot. You're going to hear a change, and it's going to be a moment happening in full tempo. Here it comes. It's a little small step. I take it out, add it to my left. Take it out. I'll add two bones, one to each foot. Out. And you can also add a scuff to this particular step. Add that to my right foot. 